Hello, my friends, and welcome back. So I sent out a message asking people, why do you want to earn your GED? This is something that is really critical for you to think about. So in this video here, I am featuring answers to this question that I posted. And if you enjoy educational videos, click that subscribe button, it's free, and ring the notification bell so that you receive notification every time I post a new video. Okay, let's go see those answers. Welcome to Purely Persistent, I'm Michelle. Rafa here says, just got it. All right, not even working on it anymore. I'm so proud of you, great job. But Rafa wants to become a soccer coach and to have the satisfaction of completing a vital step in his life. Gamer Rage, I'm 19. See, it doesn't matter what you age you are, right? You can be younger, you can be older. What matters is that you're determined. I worked as a contractor in the shipyard. Since my contract ended, I wanted to focus on my GED so I can permanently stay in the shipyard. Obtaining this credential can actually give you raises and promotions in your current career if that's the path you want to take. Chase of Havoc, to improve my quality of life and have the credential. It's essential in my point of view with the way the world is now. Honestly, I agree. It's very essential, so get this done. Miria says, I want to earn my GED because I would like to go to the university and become a medical coder. The world needs more medical coders. In fact, it's a growing career with a really bright outlook. There are many comments from folks indicating that they want to obtain their GED or high set so that they can go to college or university. Look at some of these. I want to go to university and get a better job. I need to start my studies at the community college because I want to go to college to further my studies to get a better job. I really want to go to college and make more money. So if you want more money, this is perfect for you because according to the Bureau of Labor and Statistics, the median, which means average, usual weekly earnings increases from $626 per week up to $963 per week if you obtain an associate's degree, which is just a two-year degree. And that is a $337 difference per week. What would you do with an extra $337 per week? This next one here makes me giggle. Web Trash was bored, found out there were only 28 bucks, and I was like, why not? I don't got one. <laughs> you know what, Web Trash? I'm glad you were bored and that you're doing this because your future self will thank you because you'll have a lot more opportunities with your high school diploma credential. Now, Leah Kathleen here has a very emotional story. Leah had a child at a young age and had a lot of difficulties with child protective services. She was separated from her child and really lived a challenging life. But now Leah is 27. She's in a supportive relationship where her fiance is encouraging her to get this done. And I love what she says here. I'm taking back my life and it's long overdue. Leah, you've got this, okay? You can do this. Go get your high set, your GED, and make things better. Give your son the life that he deserves. My friends. <laughs> My friends, that is it, but I wanna know, why do you want your GED or high set? Comment below and tell me, and of course, I will respond. People like you are dedicated and motivated to getting this done. How do I know? Because you watched the entire video. So, sending you my best Air 5. Don't hit your screen. <laughs> my friends, go believe in yourself. You can do this. Get your GED or your high set for whatever reason you have. I believe in you and make sure you believe in yourself too. Peace. Well, if you're going to be in, if you're going to come by, you need to be in the video. Say hi. Meow, meow. <laughs>